Hello everyone. Today we're going to talk about installation of Altinex retractors in the walls. Right here I have Altinex HDMI retractor and if you notice there are multiple holes on the side allow you to install it in different uh, configurations. In this case we have a mounting bracket which is the uh, AC226 that uh, has HDMI retractor mounted inside. You can see that there's a couple of screws on this side and a couple of screws on this side and we also have a couple of holes on each side so you can secure those screws. Once you install it into the mounting bracket it will retract from here and it can be attached to the wall. We also have uh, AC226 on the left hand side. We, this is uh, designed for podium installation and also if you have a larger wall size like 2x6 then you can install this also. All of our uh, mounting brackets come either ivory, black or white and the same thing on this side. You also get mounting screws with it and you also get uh, anchors, wall anchors. You're going to need some basic tools to get this started. First thing you will need is to download our template from our website that will tell you exactly how to mount the unit into the wall and how to do the cutout. And then you also will need a box cutter so you can cut a drywall or if you can use a, a saw if you want to do it this way, a screwdriver and also a drill bit so you can pre-drill holes before you put the anchors in. And of course the electrical drill would help also. Well with this in mind let's go ahead and do installation. Now we just uh, want to install this retractor in the wall. I put the template on top and I'm going to go ahead and uh, make a small marks where the hole is going to be. There's one. And there's another one. And then we're going to do the cutout. We're going to cut out right right ag across this edge to the wall. Okay. And that's what, uh, what's going to happen. We're going to just mark the wall first to make sure that we know the size of the cutout. Once we've done this, we're going to go, we're going to come to the wall and we're going to go ahead and cut through the wall. Okay. And, and our cutout is complete. We're just going to clean up some paper inside. Now that we have a cutout, let's pre-drill some holes so before we put anchor in. So I'm going to pre-drill one hole here on the bottom. Okay. And I'm also going to pre-drill a hole on the top. Alright, and now we're going to install the anchors. here and one anchor here. With anchors installed, we're going to put the retractor inside and push it against the wall. Now let's secure the retractor. The tractor is now secured. We can pull the cable out and we can put the cable in. And that's the installation. <laughs> 